Hi guys, welcome back to another Poundland haul. Um, so today I'm going to show you the Poundland, uh, Pound Stretcher and a little bit from huh, Aldi. We'll start with Aldi because there's only a few bits. So <laughs> I didn't need these at all, but look how pretty they are. I thought they'd go great in a, ah, just dropped it. Uh, they'll go great in a DIY somewhere or just scattered across a table or something. I don't know. But they were £1.49 each, which is actually really good. And they had all different scatters. They had like mini snowflakes, um, foil, like uh, padded stars. It was just so pretty. And then they had the mini scatter crystals as well. But these I don't have. So <laughs> I bought two packs. Um, so that was that. Uh, let's go over to Pound Stretcher. I got enlisted on buying plates for the nursery's Christmas party. So I bought two packs of these. They're just uh, little Merry Christmas ones with the cute characters. And there was 20 in there for a pound. So two packs of those. And then I see these cute little bits. This I thought would look great in a wreath. So maybe next year now um, I can sit it inside the wreath and have lots of glittery things around it. I don't know, but that was 89 pence, 89 pence. Um, so yeah, that's actually a bauble, but it's massive, but you could mount it onto a reef and make it look really cute. Um, and then I got some shred. Like I said before, I've got um, some presents that will go in gift bags and in a box. So um, I bought some iridescent shred and some silver shred um, for a pound each, they're quite good. Okay, so on to the pound shop. I found these, guys. If I'd have seen these before, oh my God. These are the window baubles. So, I don't know if you know what these are. If you've seen them before, this one's a bit more open. But yeah, so it's got a flat bit at the bottom. So you can stand it up to fill it. And then you can put characters in there or a tree or something. And then fill it. And then it hangs with the little window showing. So you could actually stick the lights in these baubles and then cover it with snow and then ha like just switch it on and off. And they're already twined. Look, they've already got hangers. How cool is that? So I bought two packs of those. That's next year's Christmas DIYs. All sorted. Um, I couldn't resist buying another pack of these because they did so well this year. Um, I'm so happy with the um stuff the craft stuff in pound sh in the pound land so yeah i bought another pack of those and i found these again they stopped ha they stopped selling them for about two weeks couldn't find them and then again yesterday was it day before i went in and here you go more polystyrene reefs they had m millions of them so i bought another one uh, so yeah that's all next year's stuff now because i've made a ton of stuff this year so that's that. Um, on to gifts. I got my mother-in-law some candles and some room diffusers, reed diffusers and some spray. Now, I love these scents. The frankincense is my favourite. It smells absolutely gorgeous. So um, there's a pack of six votives in here. So they're a bit bigger than tea lights. But I bought her the pine and berries as well because they smell great too. Um, oh, yeah. Again, smell vision needs to be a thing. And I bought the Pine and Berries room spray for her. They didn't have the frankincense room spray. They must have run out. But the actual reed diffusers have these little pom-poms on, so they're really cute gifts. Um, yeah, I'm happy with those, and, and I'm sure she'll love them as well. So they're hers. Um, I got the kids some stuff. So I got found these Hello Kitty blind... Uh, Hello Kitty. Uni Kitty blind bags. They're the Lego ones. They have these already, but... The kids love opening stuff like this and making it. It doesn't last very long, but, you know, it's something to keep them occupied on Christmas Day. These will be stocking fillers um, as the hair bands. So I bought the mermaid for my youngest. Uh, she loves playing with her hair and stuff. And the eldest one, the fox. I say the youngest one likes playing with her hair. Guys, just a few short weeks ago, she took scissors to her hair. So, um that's fun. Um, I also got some school head hairbands ready for the new year and obviously the bright ones because they love having pigtails so you can never have too many hairbands. All a pound. Um, this I found which is really cute. This will be for my youngest. 
it's like a little teddy bear uh, tea set. It's not like a tea set, it is a tea set. Seven items in there, which is really cute, and it's all porcelain as well, so they're going to get broken. But for a pound, they're a really good stocking filler for a little girl, or a little boy. Yeah, it's only a little teddy bear, isn't it? And I know little boys love their tea as well, because mine does. Um, but for mine, he does also like cars, so I bought these. Um, this, I actually want to keep myself, because I collect things like this. And it's my favourite film. I love Jurassic Park. So anything to do with Jurassic Park, um, yeah, I'm all over. But it's the die-cast cars, and there's a Jeep one there as well. The mud. He'll love those. Um, not much in there for boys. Oh, sorry, let me get comfortable. Not much in there for boys, but I did buy these uh, yucky toilets. Um, they have two characters in there. I don't know. Do they show it on the picture? Yes. So they come with like little squidgy characters and they're called Flush Force. Um, reveal to, flush to reveal, flush to reveal technology. Ew, no thanks. Uh, but yeah, I'm sure he'll love them. He will love them. Um, bought some batteries because you can never have too many batteries. These are the AAA. Um, I didn't find the AA, although we needed AA. Um, they didn't have any, sadly. Let's get closer to over here. So we got Jaffa Cakes. These were only 79 pence. Um, there's only 18 in here. The supermarkets obviously stock the bigger ones that have like 24 in there. But still, cheaper than the RRP price, right? 79 pence. Keep the kids happy for a little while. I got some anti-aging um, hand cream. This one is by number six. I love their products because they don't affect my face, as in they don't, I'm not allergic to anything in there. They're just plain, simple products and they do a good job. And it's got the coconut oil, collagen and vitamin E, which is really good. And um, I mean, they're not aging just yet, but it's good to uh, prevent it, right? Or at least help it along. So yeah, I bought some of that. Um, toothbrushes, these, I bought all the fancy toothbrushes. These are by far my favourites. I don't really care for all the fancy stuff anymore. They don't work. It doesn't work. And they don't affect... Like, they affect my teeth in different ways. So I went back to these plain, simple, boring ones. And they do a good job. They keep my teeth white and clean and plaque-free. So, yes, and they're a medium. Uh, the firmness rating is a medium. Um, bought some Listerine mouthwash. We love a good mouthwash. This one is mine. Uh, this is the Spearmint. I hate Spearmint, but, you know, mouthwash, mouth, mouthwash is mouthwash. This one is actually for my daughter. Um, she is plus. I didn't know they did this one. So they were a pound each. Uh, I got some freezer food bags, seeing as my daughter now uses, uh, has lunches. So we bought some of these. Um, nothing really special about those. This, however, I made a harness top to go underneath my bras, um, sod paying all that money for the elastic harness that you can get. I'll try and insert a photo that's not too, not safe for work, but yeah, this elastic holds up really well, even washed, it does, does a good job. So I bought two packs of those, and I did use black thread to make what I made the harness before, but these look really good. These are color blend threads, so they won't show up, hopefully. Uh, there's like a clear and a brown that will probably turn black once you've used it in there. I'm going to stop babbling. Um, the next thing I got was from Pound Stretcher. Oh, sugar. That was Pound Stretcher. That's Pound Stretcher. That was Pound Stretcher. And these are Pound Stretcher. Oops. Anyway, I got coffee. Ah, an abundance of coffee. So these are only £1.50 in the Pound Stretcher, but they're free... I think they're like two pounds something or three pounds something in uh, Sainsbury's. No, I'm not paying that much for something I can get for half the price in another shop, and they don't run out till next year. And then I also got this. These are one ninety nine, and you get twenty four sachets. Um, yeah, roasted coffee. Yeah, three in one latte by McCarty. McCarty. Um, so yeah. Not bad price. 
so guys that was the end of this haul i love it i love it i can't wait to start you know placing things we're going to hang the stockings along here um again and it's going to look fabulous the kids are going to be happy i hope and um yeah i'll see you in my next video guys probably won't be one till after christmas now but but you know that i love you all have a good christmas guys and happy new year as well love to you all thank you for watching